Nicole the Math Lady. Today we're working on lesson 13, which is all about multiplication word problems. Multiplication word problems really means word problems that involve multiplication. And the good news is you get a little hint when you're talking about multiplication word problems. You either will find a, the word product in there, or you'll find the word times. When you say something times another thing, ah, you should think multiplication. Let's take a look at this first example. Aiden's number of marbles is four times the number of marbles Joe has. If Joe has 62 marbles, how many marbles does Aiden have? So here's what we know. We know that Aiden has four times the number of marbles that Joe has, and Joe has 62 marbles. Let's set up an equation for this. We don't know how much Aiden has. That's X, that's what we're trying to find out. But we do know that it's four times four. We're going to put a parenthesis for what we're about to multiply at times. The amount that Joe has. Well, Joe has 62 marbles. All right, so all we have to do is 62 times 4. That'll find our answer. That is 248 marbles. That's your answer. Here's problem number two. Summer made 24 baskets in one minute. Ainsley made three times as many baskets as Summer. How many baskets did they make in total? So here's what we know. We know that Summer made 24 baskets and Ainsley made three times as many as Summer. We're asking, what's the total? Well, let's start with Summer. We know she's 24. And then Ainsley is three times what Summer did. So three times 24. And that'll give us our total, which we're going to use x for. So 24 plus 24 times 3. Well, 4 times 3 is 12. 3 times 2 is 6. And 1 is 7 equals x. Let's add them up. 4 and 2 is 6. 7 and 2 is 9. So total, they made 96 baskets. Okay, it's that simple. As long as you are interpreting or translating that word problem into mathematical language that you understand, and in this case, it's just when we see a times that we know a multiplication has to be involved. That simple. Okay, that's all I have for you today. It's Nicole the Math Lady. I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.